Today, I would like to share some tips with you about the Sleek Spinal Therapy System. These are the components of the Sleek Spinal Therapy System. Left and right wing, posterior and anterior Aeroflex support panels, which promote airflow. Two, Comfort Guide pull tabs for effortless compression. Crescent connectors, which align with each sizing arc. The Sleek APL adds two Aeroflex lateral support panels, which also promote airflow and increase support and Sleek. Each Sleek comes enclosed with an instructions for use, which contains the features of the brace, as well as the proper sizing and application. Right out of the package, each Sleek comes size in the smallest configuration. In order to adjust your sleek, first you want to take the proper waist circumference measurement. After you've done that, simply lift up on the Comfort Guide pull tab, adjust the crescent connector, pull out the wing, secure the crescent connector, secure the Comfort Guide pull tab, and repeat that same step on the other side. Now your sleek is ready for use. Decreasing the circumference of your sleek. Simply lift up on the Comfort Guide pull tab, lift up on the crescent connector, feed the wing back in, anywhere within the sizing arc range, and attach the crescent connector and secure it, and do the same with the Comfort Guide pull tab. Simple as that. Checking the setup of your sleek. As you can see on this side, everything is done correctly. The Comfort Guide pull tab is in the ready position. The crescent connector is aligned to the appropriate sizing arc. However, over here we have a couple of problems. First, the Comfort Guide pull tab is not attached to the, to the sleek, and the crescent connector is not properly aligned to the second sizing arc. So simply to adjust this, lift up on the crescent connector, feed the wing in, Properly secure and attach the crescent connector along with the Comfort Guide pull tab. Now the sleek is in the ready position. Now wrap your sleek. Make sure that it is snug. To tighten, pull your Comfort Guide pull tab and reattach anywhere onto the brace. Resetting your sleek. If you notice that your brace has some extra slack right here, as you can see, all you need to simply do is check to make sure that your Comfort Glide pull tabs are in the ready position. And assuming they are, what you're going to do is grab both ends of the brace and simply pull, just like this. As you can see, the string will retract and your sleek is now in the ready position. Getting your Comfort Glide pull tabs in the ready position. First, what you want to do is make sure that both of the pull tabs are attached to the brace. You can simply do this by just attaching it towards the center of the brace close to the crescent connector. Go ahead and adjust this one on the other end, making sure that it is also close to the crescent connector and towards the center of the brace. Once you've attached both of the pull tabs, you want to go ahead and remove that slack just like this, and now your sleek LSO brace is in the ready position. Sleek APL setup. To attach the Aeroflex lateral panels, simply grab them, place them on the brace, make sure the tallest side is toward the center of the brace, and the shortest side is toward the outside of the brace. Once you've done that, secure the tabs on the outside of the brace, just like this, and then repeat on the other side. Again, making sure the tallest side is toward the center of the brace, shorter side is toward the outside of the brace. Your sleek APL is now ready to use.
Sleek EXT Setup. With your Sleek EXT, you can now increase the size of your Sleek to a 62 inch waist circumference. First, you want to lay your Sleek on a flat surface. Go ahead and remove the interior panel, just like this. Add Sleek EXT by simply sliding it in. Align and secure. And then go ahead and reattach your anterior panel. Caring for your Sleek. It is important to note that when caring for your Sleek, you want to hand wash it and lay flat to dry, or you can hang dry it. You do not want to put your Sleek in the machine wash or the dryer. Another tip is to use a lint roller. You can easily use this to remove any debris or dirt that may be on your brace. 